हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू विजडम ऑफ आयुर्वेद फाइनली अ गुड न्यूज फॉर वेल विशर्स एंड बिलीवर्स ऑफ आयुर्वेद ड्यूरिंग सच ग्लोबल हेल्थ क्राइसिस इट इज टाइम टू फॉल बैक ऑन ट्रेडिशनल रेमेडीज एंड हिस्टोरिकल वर्क हैज बिगिन इन इंडिया आयुर्वेद the oldest and the ancient science of life which originate in india more than 5000 year ago often called as the mother of all healing the clinical trial on ayurvedic medicine has begun this comes at the time when search for therapeutic options against the novel corona virus is going on at the frenetic pace the world over The interdisciplinary Ayush R&D task force has formulated and designed clinical research protocol for prophylactic studies and add-on intervention in COVID-19 positive cases through review and consultative process of experts. The clinical trial that will be conducted is random single-blinded placebo-controlled trial. The trial for this Ayurvedic formulation will be done on health workers and the people working in high-risk zone. This trial is joint initiative of Ministry of Ayush, Ministry of Health, Ministry of Science and Technology through Council of Scientific and Industrial Research with technical support of ICMR. The clinical trial has been started on different Ayurvedic drugs like Vidania somnifera, Glycerisia glabera, Dinospora cordifolia, Piper longa. These drugs are previously clinically evaluated along with Amlica officinalis, Hamidesmus indicus, Sasoria lapa, Curcuma longa and Alpenia galenga. And in study it was revealed that these compound was found to decrease cough and fever with statistically high significant rate. Previous study also revealed that these drugs are organ specific immunomodulatory drug dealing with respiratory tract. Along with this Trial is also started on Ayush 64 that claims to treat malaria without side effect. Recent publication has brought attention to possible benefit of Ayush 64 in treatment of patient of novel coronavirus. Ayush 64 formulation is simple combination of aqueous herbal extract of Picrorhiza curoa, Alstonia scolaris and Spursia chirita with the powder of Cisalpinia bondiosella. In previous clinical study it was found that IU64 showed 72 to 90% efficacy in comparison to control group of chloroquine and primaquine. Along with this an ayurvedic medicine developed by Herbal Research Foundation in Kerala has also approved for clinical trial on COVID-19 patients by CTRI. Gingival H tablet which is effective against respiratory infection viral fever acute viral bronchitis has been found to be effective against the respiratory syncytial virus and influenza virus during scientific validation it has seven ingredients including herbal mineral and these have been prescribed in scientific manuscripts in vitro experiment done at the rajiv gandhi center for biotechnology has proven that there are no side effects in the human cell The approval was received from IEC based on which CTRI has proved registration to conduct random placebo controlled clinical trial to various medical college across the country. So the trial will also start on formulation that consists of Shizin aromaticum, Gingiver officinalis, Glycerisia glabera, Cinnamum camphora, Vitania somnifera, Amritthara, Rock salt, Strychnus nux vomica and honey. According to source this formulation is very good antiviral and antibacterial and start working within 2 minutes as enters in throat. Along with this immunity boosting mayor for self care during covid-19 crisis has also mentioned by ministry of ayush. This mayor can be followed to the extent possible as per an individual convenience. These are drink warm water throughout the day. daily practice of yogasan pranayam and meditation for at least 30 minutes spices like turmeric cumin coriander and garlic are recommended in cooking drink herbal tea made from basil cinnamon black pepper dry ginger and raisin once or twice a day add jaggery or fresh lemon juice to your taste if needed with this pratimash nasya therapy and oil pulling therapy is recommended Pratimash nasya is applying sesam oil, coconut oil or ghee that is clarified butter in both the nostrils in morning and evening. 
Oil pulling therapy is taking one tablespoon sesam or the coconut oil in mouth. Do not drink. Shush in the mouth for two to three minutes and spit it off, followed by the warm water rinse. This can be done once or twice a day. During dry cough and sore throat, steam inhalation with fresh mint and caraway seeds can be practiced once in a day. Clove powder mixed with natural sugar or honey can be taken two to three times a day in case of cough or throat irritation. These mayer generally treat normal dry cough and sore throat. However, it is best to consult doctor if the symptom persists. The outcome of the study. would certainly pave a new horizon in understanding the prevention potential of ayurvedic medicine during pandemic like covid-19 through scientific evidences hope for the positive results the new information will be updated boost your immunity and stay healthy